Protecting the world's species and their habitats has been at the heart of WWF's mission since it was founded in 1961. Way beyond their inherent beauty and value, species are critical for maintaining the fundamental balance of ecosystems, and as such, they are great indicators of the health of the planet. As charismatic icons, they help raise awareness for key environmental issues. However, about a quarter of the world's mammals are threatened with extinction. Habitat loss and illegal wildlife trade are key threats, as are conflict with humans over resources, bycatch, pollution, and increasingly, climate change. WWF has been fighting to save endangered species for over 40 years, and we have a number of success stories to be proud of. Ammo tigers, mountain gorillas, giant pandas, southern white rhinos, and golden lion tamarins have all seen numbers recover. Tigers are one of the most iconic and best-loved species on the planet, and yet paradoxically, they are one of the most threatened. We've seen tiger numbers decline by 95% in the last century alone. So over the next five years, the whole WWF network is coming together in a major global program to save tigers in the wild. By 2020, we're aiming to increase tiger numbers from less than 4,000 to more than 6,000. It is essential that tiger conservation becomes a sustained political priority. Habitats and prey have to be increased and improved. And we have to crack down on the trade in tiger parts and products, including markets that still exist in the UK. It is not just tigers we will be working to save. Over the next five years, WWF will be involved in vital work to help conserve species such as rhinos, elephants, orangutans and mountain gorillas. Saving species and their habitats inspires generous support. They are also at the very heart of our broader conservation work, from tackling illegal logging to addressing the impacts of climate change. It's essential that we continue to do everything we can to help save these magnificent animals and the wonderful places in which they live.